second trip of the year. Let's go through the other line. Walked into something quite substantial, quite a feel of it. Right hand rod, about 30 yards, a little snowman, chemo bait snowman, little PVA bag. About three o'clock. Does it feel big and? in the net. It looks a big one. Hell of a scrap. I had to uh, drop the camera while they got him in the net. It's made my arms ache. But I'm chuffed to bits with that one. Right, let's get him out and we'll show you him on the mat. I'll take a few stills and a bit of film of him. 30 pound. Awesome fish. Taking on the chemo beats bait snowman. About 30 yards, little PVA bag of uh, loose samples. First fish of the trip, awesome fish. Head of a fight. She goes back, 30 pound, over the moon with this one. Second trip of the year, as I say. First, first trip was a couple of weeks ago over the other side of the lake and I'd, um, I had a, like, a high mid double um, but this one just blows that one out of the water absolutely awesome let's get her back 30 pound on the nose as I said fought like an absolute demon and there she is look at the size of that head Uh, it's uh, the end of May and it's freezing. This water is freezing. It's like the bloody Arctic. It's more like autumn. There she is in the clear water. Look at that. She wants to go.
hello, it's now July, and down on the club lake again down in Kent. June was a bit of a nightmare, uh, we had a couple of trips down here, and uh, we had fish spawning, obviously, spawning late this, this year because of the weather we've been having through the spring. Uh, I had one trip up there in the bolds, um, two screaming runs, lost them both to cutoffs, which really gutting. Um, probably down to the pea mussels on the bottom because I'm fishing slack lines. Screaming run, pick up, and then cut off, reeled in, all my line was frayed. Proper pissed off with that, but never mind. Um, we're now beginning of the July. Oh, and, yeah. <laughs> and then we'll, uh, we'll see how it goes this, this trip. Um, bit more confidence, a few fish showing in front of us. Hopefully the fish have spawned and they've got that out of their system and they should be hungry for a munch. Let's see how we get on. Slabs. Catching an awful lot of them. And it's do me heading. Two and a half pound in the sling. On a floater, nothing coming off the bottom. Lee spotted a few fish off the top. So we said, let's go for them. Probably the smallest carp in the lake. But. One. Let's put it back. A little common going back off the top on a fake mixer. Let's get a kick back now. My fish, snowman. Every little thing it is. <laughs> well, after catching that uh, small common a couple of weeks ago, uh, the weather warmed up and the fish started spawning again, so we gave it a rest for a couple of weeks. But as you've just seen, I uh, just caught that uh, 22 pound mirror, 
which was nice. After a couple of week break, it was nice to get back down here and catch one. Um, the weather conditions at the moment are perfect, overcast and windy. Uh, there's a few fish topping in front. So, fingers crossed that uh, we get another one.